In this problem, we have to find the 20th term of the sequence. We're also told in the problem that this is what's called an arithmetic sequence. So an arithmetic sequence is one in which um, the terms are obtained by adding a number over and over again. So if you look here, you can see that to get from 4 to 11, we add 7. Likewise, to get from 11 to 18, we also add 7. And then to get from 18 to 25, we also add 7. So the number that you add to get from one number to the other is called the common difference. And the notation is little d. So in this case, little d is equal to 7. The first term is a sub 1, and that's equal to 4 in this case. It's this number that's right here. So using this information, we can actually um, find the 20th term. Here's the reasoning. If you're at the first term, to get to the second term, you add d one time. If you're at the first term and you want to get to the third term, you have to add D once, twice. Likewise, to get to the fourth term, you have to add D three times. So to get through the 20th term, you start with the first term and you have to add D 19 times. So 19 times D. Notice 20 times 1 is 19. 20 minus 1 is 19. So this always works. So if you were looking for like the 40th term, it would be the first term plus 39d. So they'll always add to 40. 1 plus 39 is 40. 1 plus 19 is 20. It'll always work that way. So a sub 1 is 4, and then we have 19, and then d is 7. So let's see if we put this in our calculator. It's 4 plus 19 times 7. I got 137, so that would be the 20th term.